Hi everybody. Well, it's time for our Monday job search, right? Sorry about the last video. I noticed that when I looked down, I wasn't as loud, so I will try harder. Anyway, let's get into our new video. Have you ever woke up and wondered what was wrong with you? You knew you wanted to be elsewhere, that there was more to life than the life you were living, more than the bills you were paying, the job you were keeping. Look to the horizon, to the sunsets. Your answer is there. Put your feet on the ground and take a deep breath and step into the nomadic lifestyle. You will not regret it. Hi, we're back. I know, right? Sorry, let me adjust that just a hair. So anyway, like I was saying in the beginning of the video, I noticed that the last time when I would look down to read, you wouldn't be able to hear my voice very well. We'll try to correct that. Anyway, again this week I'm excited about some of the jobs that I found. A couple of them, actually one of them I was hired at and didn't take the job. And that was my first ever job offer. And I was going to go and then I found out Betty Sue's front end was all messed up. But anyway, that's another story. I'd like to welcome my new subscribers. As of today, the, the taping of this video, I have 700 subscribers. You guys, 700. I know, right? 300 to go. Anyway, if you like my videos, please share them, like them, and subscribe. So I have a surprise that will be coming up in the next video or two. Watch for that video. Anyway, without further ado, let's get into our job help wanted today. So hot here, guys. Wait till you see the video of what happened to my scooter from the storms. Anyway, that's another story. <laughs> Anyhow, so our first job is the job that I was my, my first boondocking job. I got it. I had just been on the road two weeks. Out in, I was at the Grand Canyon at the time. And the job was in Colorado, uh, California. I was hired on as a 58-year-old pool girl. Um, and I was going to go. I was due there in October. And I was going to go. Well, between then and a month later, I found out the front end of the rig was dead. And I couldn't drive it that far. And, you know, if you watch way back in my, while I was out boondocking, you'll see the issues I had with Betty Sue. But anyway, I wasn't able to take the job. But this is a really cool place, guys. This is this RV resort caters to off-road vehicles, uh, four-wheelers, bikes, uh, all kinds of stuff. Anyway, let's get into this job. The name of the place, and I love the name of this place. First of all, it's out of Barraro Springs, California, Octavo Wells, California, same area. And the name of it is Blue Inn, as in I blew in, <laughs> RV park and campground. It's a motorsport RV resort, like I told you. They're hiring couples and singles. Their season is from October to May. Um, they will give you $10 in laundry money. They will give you a full hookup with electricity. Um, they will... And you get to join the bonfires and the parties, and you get to be a part of the crowd. This job sounded so cool to me, you guys. Um, I think there is Wi-Fi there. I can't remember. And cable TV. You would have to ask them. They didn't list it in their ad. Anyway, what they're looking for is managers and assistant managers, office workers, and maintenance. Now, maintenance is anywhere from cleaning restrooms to cleaning the pool. They have one pool. Just like I said, or they have a huge barbecue, I mean a fire pit, you could be cleaning that. But they're hiring, it looks like 25 people, easy. Um, the amenities there, you guys, is a cafe, a store, there's special events, parties, a clubhouse, a community fire pit, pit off-road vehicle uh, contest and sports, washers, dryers, showers, spas, and pools. Um, you guys, like I said, I accepted this job last year, and I never got to make it. But I spoke personally to the owner. I didn't even speak to a manager back then. I spoke to the owner. And I got to tell you, it sounds like a really good company. Something you could go back again and again and again. Anyway, uh, you want to send a resume 
with pictures of your rig, yourself, and your animal. I have to say, I don't have a resume, a re resume. I don't have a resume online. And when I wrote the owner, I just told him of the, the things I had done. I'd worked in an office. I'd been an apartment manager. I cleaned pools. I mean, I'd been a maid. Just if you don't have a resume online, write him a letter, very professional, and let him know what you can do. If it's in an office or outside or inside, if you're a maintenance man or electrical or your construction, just let him know in the letter. But make sure you send the pictures of your rig, yourself, and if you have any pets. I will list that down below. Oh, they do do a background check. They didn't say anything about drug testing. They didn't say anything to me about drug testing back then either. But I don't do drugs. Um, job number two is out of Mon Monroe, Louisiana. And it, I can't even pronounce this. I'm going to say Quactillus. <laughs> <laughs> oh, RV Park. They need someone ASAP. Office help. They will train. That's how desperate they are. If they they need just one person, but if you're a couple, then your mate stays for free. You'll be working 20 hours a week. Now, after I wrote this about the office help, they also need maintenance for 20 hours a week. It can be two separate rigs, guys. You don't have to be a, a, wife, a husband and wife team. Your compensation will be full hookup um, and weekly laundry allowance. Send your resume and your pictures too, and I will list that down below. Again, this is out of Monroe, Louisiana. I know, right? Number three. Okay. This is out of Savory, Texas. It's in North Texas. Texas. They say it's 15 minutes out of Dallas. Um, it's called Route 82 RV Park. Uh, they need a couple of camp hosts. They need a couple to work as camp host. <laughs> right? Okay. Okay, the job pays a monthly wage, you guys, of $1,200. You get free uh, RV parking and $60 credit towards your electricity. This is a long-term job. It's year-round. In other words, you're not there for a season. You're there for the whole year if you want to be. Uh, they're looking for a couple to work 40 to 45 hours a week. That'll be split between the two of you. Uh, you must be physically fit, and one of you needs to know how to drive a tractor. <laughs> right? I know, right? <laughs> so anyway, um, yeah, it sounded like an okay job. It's a full-time job. It's not something you're going to work a few months at and move on. It's something if you want to be stationary. You can be stationary. I'll leave the information below in the description of this video. I know, right? I'm talking awful fast today. It's been crazy here, guys. Ready? Okay, number four. And this is out of Crystal River, Florida. Lake Rasu RV Resort. Okay, they need a single, but again, if you have a husband or a wife, they can live there for free. Um, you can arrive any time between now and October. This is a year-round job, just like the other one. This isn't just seasonal. You can stay there year-round and, and have all those amenities. Um, they want. They are looking for someone with basic uh, office duties, data input, reservations, inventory, and other duties as needed. You must be personal, excellent at customer service. Um, you must know a computer. If you know Word and Excel, that's even better. And also, if you know the Campground Master Plus ground, Campground Master uh, program, it's a plus. So um, you will work 20 hours a week. You'll get your RV spot, electrical allowance. Uh, you get. Uh, yeah, you get work shirts, laundry quarters, and use of all the amenities activities at the club. You know what, this sounded good for that, that couple or that single that's just tired of traveling. Although, I, I've only been in here, what, two months and I'm already going stir crazy. Just saying. Anyway, yeah. description, well, I'll give you the contact information. You know, guys, anytime you send in a a resume or 
you send in a letter of experience. Always attach a picture of you and your rig and any pets you may have. And I say that to save you and to save them because the one thing that you want is a perfect fit with any RV job, any RV job. You don't want to travel at any length of time and not be accepted once you get there. Not, and don't be afraid if you got a rig that's over 10 years old. Like again, if it's well maintained and looks good on the outside, send a picture. Most they can say is no, right? That's the way I've always looked at it. And I want to tell you, the Blue Inn RV Resort, the first one I told you that I was offered a job, they seen Betty Sue and me and, me and Chloe. Chloe had a big dog at the time. Um, and they accepted us just like that. Like that. Okay. Five. This is at Crystal River, Florida. It's at the Quail Roost RV Park. This is a long term for a single. In other words, just one person will be working. We can be a couple. Um, it is full time, year round. It's 24 hours a week of cleaning. That's it. You're going to be cleaning in bathhouses, the clubhouse, and the rec hall. You guys, those are a breeze. Um, you'll get a full hookup with electricity. And again, send your pictures and work experience to the link below. I know, not as drawn out, right? <laughs> okay. Number six is out of Silver City, New Mexico. And it's called um, South, Southwestern Campers Ranch. And, um, you know, guys, yeah, it's out of Silver City. I don't know if it's a ranch or it's an actual RV park. But they say that you'll get, um, it's for full-time positions. They need more than one. Uh, the pay is an RV site. It's from September through September 1st through summer 2019. Um, they need outside maintenance, they need housekeeping, and they they would appreciate experience. And what you get is nine dollars and twenty five dollar nine dollars and twenty five cents an hour plus your RV spot. And you guys, it's only twenty hours a week. So between the RV spot. That's pretty good. I would ask them about electricity and all that because they didn't mention anything. Um, this one sounded cool to me. I mean, uh, yeah, you can't beat nine months in a spot and be paid to be there. <laughs> That's the way I look at it. Anyway, information will be down below. And this week I got a seventh one as a bonus because <laughs> that's just how I roll. Anyway, this one's out of Fort or Flyers. Let me start over right? Okay. Myers Flat, California. It's at the big Redwoods RV park and camp. You want, they want somebody to start now. It's for singles and couples. All positions are open here. Um, what you will get is, um, you will get a full hook, hookup site, hourly pay of $13 per hour, Wi-Fi cable. I know this is one of those ones I told you about. A potential bonus depending on how well you work. They want long-term and seasonal. Uh, the seasonal would be now through October and long-term would be year-round. Um, they do ask that when you send your resume, that you send a photo of you, your RV, and your pets. Again, most of them want that, you guys. So I would just send it off. Anyway, that stuff would be listed down below. <clears throat> Again, I would like to welcome, I hope that was good for you, it was good for me. <laughs> I would like to welcome all my new subscribers. And again, if you like my videos, the content of my videos, please share, like, and subscribe. And you know, you guys, I want to thank those of you who have stayed here with me. You know, even though you may not like my narcissist videos or my cooking videos, I have to say I have a little bit of everything for everybody and you know what either in the next video or the video after that I have a huge surprise for you guys <laughs> just saying anyway I also have a minced up video coming um, it shows the thunderstorms here some of the damage it's been done my scooter um, yeah it's just been crazy uh, monsoon has been a good monsoon in Arizona a lot of rain and we need it but I have to say I hate the humidity just saying and also, I'm jonesing. I miss being out on the road. Could that be my surprise? 
Hey, baby. <laughs> anyway, we'll see you next time. Remember to love yourself. Because if you don't love you, nobody can love you. Do something good for you today.